In this tutorial, we'll review the features and benefits of the Chargeify Billing Portal. The Chargeify Billing Portal provides a great way for your customers to manage their subscriptions. You can control what actions your customers are able to take, like updating their credit card and billing details, changing plans, changing the number of add-ons, canceling their subscription, all from one convenient interface. To enable the billing portal and configure the settings, start by navigating to the Config drop-down menu, then Settings, select Billing Portal, and finally click the Enable for this site radio button. After you enable the portal, you can specify whether invitations should be sent automatically to your customers when they sign up for one of your products, or if you prefer manual invitations, you can select that here. This feature is useful if you are limiting access to a specific segment of your customer base. You can then select which features your customers with Billing Portal access can modify. These include plan changes, immediate cancellations, delayed cancellations, credit card updates, profile updates including email and billing and shipping addresses, component changes, and enabling the billing portal login system. You can also display churned reason codes, allow the subscription to be put on hold, and then also resume that paused subscription. Once you've set the available features, you can set your proration scheme for customers who make mid-period product adjustments. We've provided some additional flexibility for your customers when they log into the billing portal with these management links. We recommend you require customers to confirm their email address before logging in as an added security feature. Then you can choose the merchant information which appears when your customer logs into the portal. This includes your merchant name and merchant info. You can also edit the text in the invitations which will be emailed to your customers and update your logo here. Let's take a look at how you can manage access to the billing portal for a specific subscription. First, you can click on Billing Portal under the Catalog menu to see a list of your customers and whether the portal has been enabled for their subscription. When you click on Managed Access, you'll be redirected to the Customer Subscription Overview page, where you will see the billing portal status of the subscription at the bottom of the page. You can revoke portal access or enable portal access with the option to send an invitation to the customer. If you decide not to send an invitation during sign-up, you can find the management link under the Billing Portal menu as well as the Customer Subscription Summary page, which you can send to the customer at any time. When you provide the customer with the management link at sign-up, an email is automatically generated. Once they click on the link found in the email, they will be redirected to the portal login page. Here they will be prompted to set a password if you have that security feature enabled in your settings. Once your customer has accessed the portal, they will see an overview of their subscription. Depending on the features they are able to modify, they'll be able to change their plans, cancel their subscription, configure their add-ons, and update their payment method. If you've enabled statements, they can download a copy directly from the portal by clicking Statements here at the top. When a customer updates their subscription, they'll be redirected to a confirmation page where they can preview the change and any cost associated with the change. The customer then acknowledges the action by selecting Save Changes here. Now that you know more about the Billing Portal's functionality, you can enable it on your Chargeify site and allow your customers to self-manage their subscriptions. You can find additional information on these features in our documentation at help.chargeify.com or by contacting our support team at support at Chargeify.com. Thanks for using Chargeify, and have a great day.